I don't know what the secret of success is, but here's what I know what the secret of failure is. Trying to please everybody. You can be world class, you can fit in with the world, you don't get to do both. If you want to have the results only 5% of the population has, you've got to be willing to think and behave like only 5% of the population. And if you do these kinds of things, the world will call you eccentric. This is where you got to develop the interior core, where it doesn't matter if people call you crazy. One of the things limiting you from your income, your impact, a world-class life. You care too much about what people think about you. Sounds really obvious. Everyone has an opinion. Why let the opinions of other people deny you from a life that will make history? Why are you so antisocial? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you staying on the basketball court so much? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you out there practicing in the hot sun when ain't nobody else out there? Because I'm trying to get it. Why are you not clubbing? Like every time I text you and invite you to go do something fun and cool, you always studying because I'm trying to get it. You ain't doing nothing. And for those of us who get up and go out, you got something to say about how we do what we do it. Stop talking to us who perform it. Stop telling us what to do and how to do it. You keep gossiping and I'll keep working. You keep talking smack and I'll keep working. You keep focusing on everyone else and I'll keep working. And when you finally look around at where you are and where I'm at, you realize that you have nothing left to talk smack about and you will lose and I will win you don't have time to worry about anybody else's course because it's going to take all of your energy all of your intensity all of your fervency to keep yourself on track that's why it's important for you to work on yourself, listening to tapes, building yourself up, talking to yourself with power, feeling, and conviction, day in and day out. You've got to focus on you. And as you convince you, as you sell yourself, every day, every day, every day, you will begin to see a difference in the things that you're doing. Selling yourself on your ability to perform a job, to achieve a certain objective. Telling yourself every day, here I go again, and I got what it takes. This is my day, and nothing out here is going to stop me. I'm going to fail, I'm going to fail, I'm going to fail, I'm going to fail, and I will succeed. Just get me against me, period. I'm going to fucking make myself good enough. I'm driven. I'm obsessed. I want to prove people wrong. And you've got to learn how to tune out the critics outside and the critic inside. And since I'm going to do this, I'm going to harness my will, and I'm not going to let anything stop me. Stay on that basketball court. Stay on that football field. Fuck all the homies texting and calling and trying to make you feel bad about being so focused. It's grind season, homie. It's not about today. It's about the future. Do the work now and all of the shit that you could ever want to do for your family, your kids, your loved ones, it's all going to be on a whole other stratosphere. It's you if it's going to happen. Not about the failures, not about your disappointments, not about the defeats, not about your mistakes, not about what you don't have, not about who doesn't approve of you, who doesn't like you. All that's insignificant. Your life is in your hands. You have the power to turn your life around. You've got the power to snatch victory from the jaws of defeat. You've got the power to be daring. And it's on you to be that decisive about your life.